So what I did for my capstone is I went ahead and I started with the very simplest of simple for how can I be heard and make a difference in Utah. Um, for those that are specifically doing it for a cause or for those that are just interested in understanding what lobbying is about, what are lobbyists and who can be a lobbyist. Um, and citizen lobbyist training. For those that are wanting more in-depth information, I decided that I would go ahead and I would put some a package together for legis the legislative toolbox um, and more in-depth information for the Utah um, state government organization charts and the bills, budgets, and fiscal notes so that it could be set up for anybody from the very basic to the very um, in-depth. Um, in addition to that, I did go ahead and put a, a DVD together that would allow students who would rather see and, and prefer or, uh, the, the more verbal and visual concepts to be set up. Um, and one of the trainings that was offered here at the Salt Lake Community College, um, I recorded that so that students would have an opportunity to just watch that rather than have to read if they have a preference. Um, after doing this and finding what I understood and the need for, for people to represent themselves, I decided to go ahead and work with student um, life and leadership upstairs. And in doing that, I ran for student government as the executive vice president. The executive vice president has the opportunity to work with the student senate and to share the passion and the information that I have learned and to help other students to see how they can make a difference was something that I was interested in. And after and while doing that, I was able to continue a lot of the things that I had worked so hard with um, the service council and the Thames Center for Service and Learning. The American Reads program was an amazing opportunity to work with students who were in third grade and who were struggling with reading. And beyond that, if they were struggling with reading, they were more than likely struggling with math and, and other subjects. And so just going in, a assuming I was going to be working just on reading, I found myself immersed in, in the different subjects that the students needed help and the relationship and the rapport that I was able to build with them just really helped me to, to strengthen my desire to build on my own passion. Um, while doing that, I also was able to start working with a group that um, focused on people with severe disabilities, intellectual disabilities, and the passion that came from helping and advocating those, for those people really helped me to find a desire to do something more with even my career. And that's where I decided to move from elementary education to special education where I would be able to <coughs> impact students from kindergarten through 12th grade who had disabilities. By doing a lot of these things, I also was able to set an example for my kids and to help them to be exposed to things that they might not have otherwise understood. And so the impact that the Thane Center and the Civically Engaged Program and all of the volunteer opportunities had went from me as a person to other students, but also to future generations. And for that, I can't even express how amazing and how wonderful my opportunities have been here. Great.